my theatre troupe will be coming for dinner before tonight's performance. Have dinner ready for all ten of them by the time they arrive at seven o'clock. Buy the food, prepare it, set the table, serve dinner, clean up afterwards, and stay out of our way. None of us know how to cook. That's true. I knew how to repair those windows and clean the chimneys, because those things interest me. But I don't know how to make anything but toast. And sometimes you burn the toast. I wish our parents were here. I hate it here, Violet. I hate this house, I hate our room, and I hate Count Olaf. I hate everything about our lives too, Klaus, but we have to keep our chin up. You're right, but it's very difficult to keep one's chin up when Count Olaf keeps shoving it down. Juke! Perhaps you could find a cookbook and read about how to cook. I can't say I'm surprised. We didn't find any books in this house at all. I know. I miss reading very much. We must go out and look for a library sometime soon. Who in the world would want to visit Count Olaf? Perhaps somebody wants to visit us. It's just a Strauss. How lovely to see you. Forgive me for not stopping by sooner. I wanted to see how you children were settling, but I have an important case in the High Court. What sort of case is it? I can't really discuss it, because it's official business, but I can tell you it involves a poisonous plant and an illegal use of someone's credit card. Yika! Yika, indeed. Now then, how are you children getting along? Is there anything you need? Could we perhaps borrow a cookbook? Count Olaf has instructed us to make dinner for his theater troop. Goodness! Cooking for an entire theatre troupe seems like a lot to ask from the children. Count Olaf gives us a lot of responsibility. Why don't you come next door and find a book that suits you? My word! This is a wonderful library! Thank you very much. I've been collecting books for years, and as long as you keep my books in good condition, you're welcome here any time. If you don't mind, I would like to take a look on your books concerning mechanical engineering. Inventing is a great interest of mine. And I would like to look at books on wolves. Recently, I've been fascinated by the subject of wild animals of North America. Book! It's a pleasure to see young people interested in books. We should probably find a recipe first, don't you think? Listen to this. Putnesca. It's an Italian sauce for pasta. All we need to do is cook olives, capers, anchovies, garlic, and tomatoes in a pot and prepare a spaghetti to go with it. That sounds easy. And I would like to look at books on wolves. Recently, I've been fascinated by the subject of wild animals of North America.